And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, as we continue on with our journey in the Nevada desert in Fallout New Vegas. Uh, last time, we traveled to Prim, where we were trying to get some information on the uh, platinum chip that we were supposed to deliver. Um, so I just got to Prim. I found out that it's been taken over by bandits, so I went into uh, the town, killed a couple bandits, and then walked into the casino here. <sighs> I really don't understand, though, why, even if the world's falling apart, why people don't clean up their crap. Alright, so, let's check our mission, make sure we know what we're doing. Finds Prim's lawman to get information where your attackers went. Find the men who tried to kill you. So I believe that last time we talked to somebody and they said that the lawman had been taken captive. I believe that's right. Um, so we're going to try and find him. Now I'm pretty sure he's in the casino there. But let's go around town to check. Now one thing that's always fun to do is when you're walking through a town or just, you know, out in the wilderness, um, check garbage cans and dumpsters and thing like th things like that because you can find some pretty interesting things sometimes. Uh, money and then other useful things. Like a pack of cigarettes weighs little and it uh, is worth a bit. Sheriff's office. Let's take a look in here. Alright, so obviously he's not here. But we can take a look around. Now, if you remember, everything that is yellow, when we move our mouse over it, we can take. It means we're not stealing, as long as it's yellow. If it's red, though, we are stealing. So here's some ammo. Let's take that. Alright, so this computer doesn't work. Let's check the desk. Alright, there's some more ammo. Oh, jeez. Um... Mrs. McBain's corpse? Holy crap. They blew their heads off. A piece of a jaw. That's creepy. Brahmin skin outfit. Okay. Well, looks like obviously he's not here. He was killed. So, what's this over here? Let's check. Another shack. Mail drop box. Bobby pin. Bobby pins are good to take because bobby pins are what you use to pick locks. So those are always good. Oh. Now that's red. That means that it's breaking and entering. Or we can't steal stuff because it belongs to somebody. Alright. I'm just trying to get an idea of what happened here. There's some grilled mantis, harmonica, squirrel stew. That looks appetizing gun case. Okay, let's go ahead and try and pick this lock. So I don't know if I've explained lock picking yet, uh, if you haven't seen it. Uh, basically you move the bobby pin back and forth and you press right and left to turn with the screwdriver and you're trying to find a place with the bobby pin where the screwdriver can turn all the way like that. Holy crap. Let's take all of that. I'm over encumbered. I knew it. Okay, let's go see if we can repair some things. Sell something. Let's see if we can go sell some stuff. Um, oh shoot, I don't want to be so slow. Let me see if I have anything to make me faster. So sometimes you can look in your aid and you can find items that increase your strength. So if I can find something that increases my strength for a little bit, it means I can carry more. And that means that I can get to uh, the store without being over encumbered so let's see if I have anything that will help with that alright so slow going while we're going back ever so slowly um, I just wanted to thank you guys for watching uh, these videos um, if you this is your first time watching these videos uh, please go back, watch some of the other videos, watch the character creation, watch where we've been, what we've been doing, um, and then watch more as we put them up. Every Friday we're putting up a new episode of this one, 
Uh, I think the episodes are going to be a little bit longer, starting with this one, um, because we seem to be getting some pretty consistent viewers on this. Um, and we've got a bunch of other videos that are great. We've got MOBA Mondays, which Andrew does most of the time, and uh, something new on Wednesdays as well. Sometimes we'll play a co-op game. Uh, we got some new games from the new Humble Bundles, so check those out. We'll be putting those up pretty soon. And those are always fun and uh, always worth it. Uh, for pay what you want, you can always get some pretty good games. I'm interested to know how that sign is still spinning. What is powering that sign right there? There's still some electric lights and stuff. I guess there must be electricity. Okay. Let's find somebody to buy our crap. What are all these people doing? They're just kind of standing around with weapons. Hello. Hey there. Why are you just holding a gun? <laughs> what is happening right now? There's like one guy over there drinking, and everyone else is walking around with like a weapon. Who are you? Before the powder gangers came to town. Johnson Nash ran the local you store and the Mojave creepy. Express station. Ruby? Hello there. Who are you? I'm Ru My husband. What do you cook? The ve- It's- I'd like to buy some Does casserole. Sound good. I don't have any. Guess you'll be needing- What? You'll- but You'll make it and sell it to me, but I have to bring it to you? Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's talk to Johnson then. Hey, youngster. Um, uh, what was strange about it? That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Here. Last word I have in the office, it looked like paint. So again, if you're just joining us, um, the game starts off with my character getting shot in the head, basically, from a, uh, a transaction gone wrong. Uh, the character is a courier who delivers stuff across the Mojave Wasteland, and apparently he had a platinum poker chip, and uh, the person wanted it, and so they took it and shot my character. But I was rescued, patched up by the doctor, and that's where our character creation comes in. And uh, now I'm on a mission to figure out who the heck shot me and why. Just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. Do you have anything for sale? Okay, good. Now we can sell some stuff. So let's take a look at our weapons. I don't need a shotgun. Ammo. Well, I'm not using shotgun, so I guess I can get rid of all that ammo. Okay, we'll keep that. Uh, except, let's see if I'm still overburdened. Pleasure doing business with you. Goodbye. Good. Nope. Okay. Now I can move around. What the heck is this? Look at this. Drink or I'll shoot you. No, leave me alone. Who are you? Just a bunch of residents. Okay, let's go find the deputy because apparently the sheriff and his wife were killed in bed, which is a terrible way to get killed. Obviously, their heads were blown off. Parts everywhere. Alright, so I'm pretty sure they're in this casino. But as I recall, there might be some people sneaking around somewhere. There might be a better way in the casino than the front door, which is pretty obvious. So let's see about sneaking in somewhere. Maybe there's a door up here. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, there's binoculars. Oh, here's some drugs. Psycho, Jet, Vodka, Jet, Pack of Cigs, Binoculars. Sure, we'll take those. Right, let's see. Anyone at home? My perception's not great on this character. If you watch the character creation, you'll see... I, I basically made this guy with lots of luck, and I apparently just fell. Lots of luck, but everything else kind of sucks, um, except charisma. Lots of luck and charisma, that's what this guy has. Oh, dumpster diving? No, nothing. Let's go around back, see if there's a door back here. Uh, no, it's locked over. 
What about going up this rail? Can I go up this rail? Alright, let's see. Uh oh, I need to run. I want to run. I can't ever remember how to run. No. Maybe this is running. I should probably look up that control. I know there's a way to run a little faster than this. Okay, let's see. Yep, here's a door. Let's go in here. We'll try to sneak up around whoever is in here. Alright. Oh, shoot. I already know I'm here. What was that? So right now I'm in sneak mode. If you have a high enough sneak, you can go ahead and sneak right past people. My sneak is not high enough yet. Alright, let's... Uh, what other weapons do I have? Maybe there's a better weapon than this, like, machine gun I'm using. Um, maybe... Should I use a pistol? Maybe my rifle would do better long range. Let's try the rifle. Yeah, there we go. I can kind of aim on it. I don't see anyone here. Oh, there he is. Ooh, I got him in one shot. Did you see that? Oh yeah, I'm good. That was a headshot. That's what it's all about. I don't see anybody else down. Oh, there's enemies. They're just not in view. They must be in a room. Let's see, are they in that? In that room? Let's see if I can get him to. Oh, he walked out of view. Walk back, walk back. You like that? No, not really. No. no. Shoot. Someone else is gonna come find me now. Gotta be ready, gotta be ready. Nobody else heard that, really? Wow. Not the brightest of the bunches. Not uh, these guys. Oh, so many books. I will have to come back and steal all these books. Is there a guy over here? No. A vending machine. Ooh, bottle caps and Nuka Cola. So, bottle caps are your currency. Um, so, you want to pick up bottle caps if you can find them. Oh, and shoot. Oh, 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 how do I do? There we go. You go in vats. So vats is our aiming system. Let's try for his head. Oh, I got him twice, but it wasn't enough. Really? That didn't kill him? Let's wait around the corner here. There we go, got him. Come on! Someone else is coming around the corner. Let's get him in vats too when he comes. There we go. So these guys are convicts. Try and take him out. Oh, he crippled his head. That's good. Oh, shoot. Got him. Alright. Maybe... Nobody else heard that. Oh, there's somebody else. Don't come over here. I need to heal. So I'm playing in hardcore mode, so when we heal, it takes time. So let's find... something to heal. So these are raw ingredients. I can use those to create different things, but I don't want to use those right now. Let's eat a steak. 3 HP in 15 seconds, so one of those and one of those. Let's see if that's enough to heal us all the way. Now I'll come back and loot these guys later, but uh, let's take those. I don't have a lot of inventory space right now. I can't lift much more. So I can't take a whole bunch. Oh. Ooh, that's like a, a ramp to upstairs. That's pretty cool. Ah, so many books, so little time. Anything in here? Pack of cigarettes. Okay. Oh. Just realized I saw some enemies. Okay. So maybe they're in this next hallway. Aha! He saw me, so I'll wait till he comes around the corner and hit him with bats. Come on, dude. Get me if you can. Hope. Gotcha. 
Boom, boom, boom. Shoot! Oh, he's too close, too close. I don't know how I could miss, though. Got him. Uh, what if the other guy's gonna be right around the corner, though? No, he's in a room, apparently. Alright, let's see if we can go find him. I don't want these guys sneaking up on me later. That would be no good. I don't see anyone there. I don't see anyone there, so he must be in this room here. Huh. Or he's upstairs. Alright, well, if he's upstairs, I've got to go up there. I can either use that ramp that I saw, or what's this? Doors I can't use. Lock door, very easy. Okay. You do get XP for picking locks, so if you find them and you can pick them, do it. Empty. Oh, first aid's always good. Sure, take all. Doctor's bag. Doctor bags um, heal broken limbs, so those are always good to take. Those are some things you could use to build new items if we were crafting, but I'm not going to be crafting, so I'm not taking those. Let's see if there's any bottle caps in here. Two Nuka Colas. Ah, uh, they weigh a pound each, but I can get a bottle cap from them. Shoot. Uh, nope, I do not have, I do not have the inventory for it. What is this? That's the door empty. Alright, so I don't need to sneak right now. I need to go back to that room that had the path to the upstairs. So let's do that. So over here, let's check what these guys have on them. There's some bottle caps. They don't weigh anything, so we'll take those. Cases don't weigh anything. Um, I'll have to come back for some of that other stuff. Let's check you. Bottle cap, case, medex doesn't weigh anything. Ooh, dynamite. Dynamite's always nice, but I don't have room. NCR money. Oh, that's interesting. There are some other types of money, apparently. I know the NCR is the New California Republic, so they have some of their own money, apparently. If you're wondering, the case that I keep picking up from these guys is used to make um, new ammo, I believe. Yeah, that sounds right. Is to make new ammo. So you can break down other old ammo and make new ammo. Oh, so many books. Ooh, a ransom note. That's interesting. I'll have to go look at that later. Uh, so many books, a little time. Gun cabinet. Ooh. Maybe I should take over this hotel. I should just, like, I'm living here. Alright, where was I? Alright, so the path upstairs was in the room next to this one. Oh, there's some bottle caps on the desk. You should always just check around whenever you go someplace because there's always hidden things in desks and other places like dressers that are just sitting on their side oh pre-war money you can find things okay so this is the upstairs oh see and look over here there's a armor case leather armor grunt armor so you can find all sorts of things like that all right go back to the sneak mode because i know there's more people up here somewhere suitcase cigarettes right now. Okay. Oh, there's a guy very close. I don't see anyone over here, but that guy must be right over there. Uh, Sunset Sarsaparilla. So that's like Nuka Cola, but that one's actually unique to New Vegas. They didn't have that in Fallout 3. Um, that's something that's only here in New Vegas. So in this room, and we can get him. He's sleeping. Ah, oh, shoot! He woke up. Shoot him! Shoot him before he wakes up. 
really? Over here. Shoot. Had enough. Dude, I'm shooting you. Just die. Alright, Vats. Don't let me down this time. You were not that impressive. Shoot him again. There we go. Alright, got him. Money. Bobby pin. Case. Mentats. And a worn key. That might be useful. I'll take that. Right, I'm a little bit injured again, so I'm going to take the Sunset Sarsaparilla. I'm going to go ahead and use... I'll use a Nuka Cola to heal a bit. That should give me... 58 HP, so that's plenty. Let's check my other stats because I know that I've got to keep up on my H2O and my food and my sleep. Am I dehydrated already? Shoot. Uh, purified water. There we go. Now, where am I sitting at? Okay. Now I'm good. Now I'm good. Okay, I didn't see anyone else up here. Yeah, this guy was all alone in here. Why was he sleeping on a bloody bed? Seriously. Yeah, that was the room downstairs. Nothing in the desk. Oh, I'm so gonna have to come back and steal all these books. Maybe a book hoarder. Um, anything over here? I can't get over there, so I don't know. There's a Nuka Cola I can take. Let's go back and see if there's there's nothing else. So I gotta go back downstairs. Well, where do I go then? Cause I thought I'd gone everywhere down here. Uh, I suppose there's that door over here. Wasn't there? All right, let's go to the door over here and see where that takes us. All right, let's go back in the sneak just in case. Just in case. Oh yeah, so this is uh, another part of the hotel. Okay, this is where we need to be. Okay, I imagine there will be several more people down here. Oh, yep, I can see one now. Come on, come into view, bastard. He's not, he's going to stay right behind the corner. Anything? Oh, I can't carry all those. All right. Oh, oh! He just came around the corner firing. Did you see that? No hesitation. Oh, there's another guy in that chair over there. I saw him. I wonder if he's going to come after me. Quickly reload before they come after you. Come on. Come on. Guess it was nothing. <laughs> Did you hear that? Guess it was nothing. Come on. Oh, critical strike. Nice. Reload. It's always good to reload when you have the opportunity because you never know. The next time we'll have it is. Oh, I missed that time. Shoot. He just ran away. What the heck is that? Why would you just run away? He knows I'm here. What the heck? I do not understand the behavior of people sometimes. Let's take his money, take his case. I uh, don't have room for anything. Oh, wait, he had some drugs. Those don't weigh anything. If it doesn't weigh anything, it's your friend. You want to take it. Mole rat meat. Uh, I'll pass on the mole rat meat. Uh, let's see. Anything over here? Big double doors. There's like a store area. Teddy bears. 
drinking glasses, some more books, cash registers. What are these guys doing in here not taking the, the cash from the cash registers? Seriously. Oh, there's a floor safe. Oh, I can't pick it yet. Bottle caps. Did that guy finally come back? I think he did. Let's shoot him in the arm carrying the weapon. Oh. oh, I missed that time. Dang it. Just kind of sitting there. What the heck are you doing, dude? Damn. What the crap? He just ran away again. Worst criminal ever. It's my opinion. I think this is the front door. Yeah, that looks like the front door. What is this? Locked? I can't pick it. Computer terminal. So I don't know if I've done any hacking yet. I don't think I was able to do it in Good Springs. Hacking is interesting. Um, basically what you have to do is find the correct password. So you have four tries and you have all these different words here and when you pick one it tells you how many letters were correct out of the total and so you want to eliminate words so you want to take a look at what you have um, and find common words with common things and eliminate them so like if I wanted to do heading if I wanted to try that I know I have an ING and what's more, I have D-I-N-G, which some of these have. So we'll try that. Two out of seven correct, which means that any of the words with I-N-G at the end aren't right because I-N-G would mean we'd have three out of them correct. So what you want to do next is go to your other words and see if you can match up any of the letters in the same places to see if you have the, the same number. So granite, I have the... A and the I in the same place and nothing else common so that could be possible and it was so usually it's a little more difficult than that um, but this was an easy one so it gets diff more difficult disengage lock so usually you'll have at least one or two different ways to open locks you can either pick the locks or you can uh, find a computer terminal nearby so that unlock this door Holy cow. And let me in. Oh, there's a, a key. Some other stuff. A lunchbox, a harmonica, bubble gum. I did lose an HP, so let's go ahead and heal a bit. Especially in hardcore mode. I want to make sure that I don't fall behind on the healing. Um, that should be almost enough. Otherwise, I'll, I'll end up dead pretty quick. So let's go back here. Had enough? Had enough? What are you talking about? You haven't done anything, dude. You keep running away. Look at that. It's a contortionist. Money, bottle caps, case, a metal spoon. What the heck is this guy doing with a metal spoon? What a weird ass game. Okay. Alright, let's move on to this way. Oh, I see more people. Quite a few more people. Shoot. I wonder if I can draw them out here. I do have some dynamite. I wonder if I can throw that. I bet I can. Let's see if I can throw the dynamite. Weapons. Dynamite. Let's see about throwing that. 38%. Uh, sure. Ah, that was not even close. I think, if anything, that just hurt me. Yes, it did. Run, run away, run away. Had enough? I think I need to go back to my other weapon. Let's go back to our 10 millimeter pistol. Do that. I should probably start 
healing myself because I'm going to get hurt in this fight. I know it. So we'll go ahead and eat two steaks and hopefully that will keep us healed as we're fighting. Watch out! Okay, that's it is because this is not working. Boom. Oh, I got him. Reload. That's okay, this guy. Holy crap, this pistol's powerful. Shoot him up. Okay, anyone else? I like that that's healing me as I as I'm fighting all around me and people are dying and falling apart. I um I can pick up that dynamite since I use the other one. Uh, if I pick up this rifle, I can heal. I can use it to repair my other one. So let's do that. It makes me encumbered, but I'm going to be using it to heal, so or to repair. More dynamite. Okay, so let's go ahead and repair that varmint rifle so I can move. So again, you just go in your inventory, repair, pick the similar item, and it, it brings the condition up a bit. What's my pistol like? Oh, I suppose I can take their pistols and repair that too. Do you have a pistol? You have some rounds. I'll take those. Alright, let's repair the pistol. I know I'm not using the 9mm one, but it's good to have your weapons in good repair. They do more damage that way. Alright. Any other bad guys in here? There's some bad guys over there. I don't see any more in this room. So let's see about going over here. There's a friendly. The yellow is a friendly guy. I see you. Let's see your head fly. No, shoot him. Oh, oh my goodness, his head did fly. Wow. Did you see that? Holy crap. It's like the side of his head. There's an ear. There's an ear there. Part of his jaw. Jeez Louise. Okay. Bottle caps, case, dirty water, rounds, and the varmint rifle. Okay. Let's repair the varmint rifle again. There's a certain point where I know I'm not going to be able to repair it anymore because I won't have a high enough skill. Well, that guy, he can just wait while I'm checking out this other stuff. Okay. No, I don't want to pickpocket. Talk. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my finger. You must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes I am. I'm in a bit of a... How'd you end up being a hostage? I must say it's been the low point of... The powder gangers stole into wow. town at night. Oh, so they're the I ones that killed the sheriff and his wife. I watched them for a bit, waiting for the right to my dismay. Wow, okay. I'll set you free now. Oh, that's just more. If you try to win a rain instead of fighting at my side, I'll kill you myself. Uh, I don't need to be that mean. Oh, that's so gracious. Okay. Alright. Dude, I did all, actually all kill them all already, so I mean, you don't really have to sneak. I suppose somebody with a high enough sneak could have just kind of snuck in here and released him, but uh, I didn't actually do that. Alright, so let's follow him. What are you doing, dude? That's what it looks like when you sneak, apparently. You look like a hunchback. Sanctuary! Sanctuary! Yeah, whatever. All right, dude, you're free. I just walk away yeah. nonchalantly. Okay, so talk to me. Well, that was cool. breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to wow. do it, of course. You just took but it was quite credit for that. Problem is, there's still no law in print. All right, you're the sheriff now. Oh no, I'm just the deputy, and I can't. What are your qualifications, for sheriff? It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Meyer. Also, with the NCR so close by. Okay, I'll help bring you Law will. back. That's just marvelous. The sheriff that you also may be able to convince. 
Hey, oh, come back, come back, come back. Come back. Finding a suitable candidate? Tell me about the man in the checkered suit. Ah, yes. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers. When some great... They were talking about some delivery they took uh, from the yep, that was me. They said they'd be heading through Nipton, Nipton to Novak. To Novak. There. Okay, so I need to go to Novak. Um, good. So let's check my quests now. Uh, my kind of town. So I should do that one before I leave. That's finding a sheriff for Prim. So let's see if I can do that. He said I convinced the NCR down there. I don't want to go to the prison because that's full of powder gangers. I don't want to deal with that right now. Let's see if anyone here might be able to help. Hey there. Let's talk. You, Johnson. Hey, youngster. Yes. Um. How can I help bring the rule of law back? Your guess is as good as mine. I heard of one fellow what got him Yeah, that's the sheriff guy up there. I'm not doing I'm that. NCR. Erg. Prim Slim? Who's that? Well, I guess I never thought of that. Programmed. I guess. A robot? Okay. Bye. Is it this robot? Let's go see. Howdy. Hello, sir. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino these robots. and Museum. hilarious. Try to reprogram him using three fission batteries, batteries and four conductors. Do I have those? Ah, oh, shucks. System runtime error. No, I don't. Unable have to. Them. Okay. I need 30 science. So if I level up, Appet if I level up, I can level up science and I can just reprogram him. For some reason, I doubt that the NCR is going to help if they haven't already. I mean, I'll go talk to them, but if I can't do that, we'll go see if I can kill a few things to level up. Um, I think if I put away my gun, I move a little bit faster. Okay. So let's go see. It's nighttime right now. I love the nighttime in this game. You can see stars and everything. It's very pretty. Ooh, I don't want to fall down there. Okay. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. They are mines. Crap, I need to lay down in a bed. Don't look at me, dude. With my limbs broken, I'm I'm a little bit slow. I need to sleep in a bed to heal those. That's okay, I probably need to sleep anyway. Let's see if I can sleep in here. Are you the commander guy? Hey, Sergeant McGee. I'm Sergeant McGee. Oh, uh, you don't have anything Sir. interesting to say. Command tent. Sergeant. Sergeant. Lieutenant. Back up, Lieutenant. I need to talk to you. Then I'm going to sleep in your bed. Come on now. Yeah. Prim is in dire need of some real law. We know Prim is a great strategic point. We don't have the guns or the personnel need. What we need. If we had just one more squad, we huh. could easily If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of more Knight troops, or oh, I don't want to go anywhere else. Sir, uh, let me sleep in his bed. We'll sleep for an hour. See if that heals us. No, that did not. Okay, okay. Let's sleep for a couple hours. What time is it? It's 10:50 p.m. So let's sleep until. Whoa, not 13 hours. Uh, 10 hours puts us at 8, 9 hours, sure, let's do that. So sleeping should heal you a bit, it should repair limbs, but it might not do that in hardcore, I didn't think about that. And it should bring our sleep down. Shoot, it didn't heal me that much either. Oh, I'm dehydrated. Okay, let's fix all that. Aid. Drink some dirty water. Okay, doctor's bag, that fixed something, I don't know, some gecko steaks and some grilled mantis, that's my stats right now, condition, shoot, uh, doctor's bag, fixing my limbs, oh crap, 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we had a, a small problem with the camera. Uh, Stop recording uh, right there as we come out of the tent. So we're going to go ahead and for now we're going to call this good for an episode. So thank you for watching. Next time we will bring Law back to Prim and we'll head on to Nipton and whatever the other town was that we need to go to to find the people that shot me in the head because that was no good. So, if you like this episode of Till Death Do Us Part, Fallout New Vegas, please join us again next time, uh, next Friday, and like the video, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more like this. Please leave a comment if you have any suggestions for something else to play, or if you want to see us play more of something we've already played, and uh, we will try and do that. So anyway, please have a wonderful time, and thank you for watching.